One of the most difficult and subjective decisions you need to make in musky fishing is lure color. You know, you can always match the hatch, trying to go with natural colored baits in clear water or brighter colored baits in dark water, trying to match the predominant bait fish. You can try to do all of that and maybe it doesn't work. You got to be conscious that every lake that you fish may have an idiosyncrasy insofar as certain baits are going to work better on that lake than others. Um, there's always the dark day, dark bait adage. Dark blades with a crappie tail on the Meps Musky Flashaboo. You know, the clouds covered up the sun, went to a dark bait for a dark evening, and a big fish hit. And of course, bright day going with a bright bait will work too. Um, in certain conditions, you want to have certain colors though that work that are going to work better for you. In uh, say at night, you're going to want to have baits that have lots of contrast. Black tends to work. Um, you know, so if you go with black baits, black skirts on your bucktails, black crank baits, that's all going to work a whole lot better for the most part than going with something that's brighter or a light colored bait. One of the ways that lure color gets subjective is when you're trying to match the color to the water and the sky condition on that given day. And what I mean by that is, is sometimes you might have a gray day, you know, that's just a, a, a white sky, lots of wind, the water kind of has a funky color to it. And going with a bait that kind of looks gray and kind of blends in rather than standing out can work in that situation because the fish can often feel that bait coming through the water. Say you've got a silver blue silver bucktail and it's zooming through the water. They can sense that it's there. They know it's there but they can't see it as well. So they're much more prone to make a mistake. My good buddy Jim Sarek says you know if the bait is in the water and you could take a magic marker and trace its outline and do a good job of it, that bait is probably too bright to use in those conditions. But if the edges are real fuzzy and indiscernible then that's the bait to use because the fish is much more prone to grab that because they can't see it too well until it's too late and they've made a mistake and you've hooked them. And all I did is I went to a silver blue silver Meps Musky Flashaboo here and this bait um, you know looks very gray in the water especially on a day like today it's getting kind of gray and I guess that looks like a Cisco or Tulabee or at least it did to that fish. 